Now, the United States will soon have a truckers' protest of its own inspired by their Canadian counterparts. U.S. truck drivers are gathering in California and planning to drive over 2,500 miles to Washington, D.C. to protest against COVID restrictions and mask mandates. The organizers call themselves the People's Convoy and the drive to Washington is expected to take 11 days to complete and the cost of thousands of dollars in gas and lost earnings. The drivers, however, think that their cause is worth the sacrifice. By the week, probably $4,000, you know, so uh, once we get rolling, you know, it's uh, $680 a day to fill the truck up. So uh, food and stuff out there on the road, it, 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 it adds up, but uh, it's just kind of a necessity right now. We, we need to do this for our country. I stand up for freedom. Um, I don't feel like what the government's trying to enforce with vaccinations and over-inflating everything. I don't, I don't feel it's right. I feel like things need to go back to a more simple way of life, I guess. According to organizers, the Washington-bound convoy is expected to arrive in the U.S. Capitol on the 5th of March. In preparation for the arrival of the protesters, the Pentagon is expected to approve the deployment of 700 to 800 unarmed National Guard troops to the nation's capital to remain. And it remains to be seen if the U.S. convoys will seek to actively shut down the streets of the capital the way their Canadian counterparts did in Ottawa. That brought, uh, that brought a tear. Beyond is now available in your country. Download the app now. Get all the news on the move.